Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Fire Emblem 7. Um, we're gonna have Marcus go here. You look like you have some experience. Okay, what does he give me? Secret book is good. It increases skill. It's good. So, the strategy for this, right, is, um... Here. It's time to introduce you to rescuing. It's like pair-up, but actually, like, tactical instead of just pointless. So we can take and drop. I'm, I level Elliewood a lot in the beginning, so I don't forget to do it later. Um, I don't know. I always favorite certain units and then just like let them do a lot of stupid combat. Oh. Another one. Another one. That's actually good that he's getting criticals, because he needs strength like really badly. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to get low on some points of experience too. But watch this, it's a, it's a guy who we've not seen before, mercenary, so... What do they sell? Nothing, thank you. Lowen only has a javelin for, um, that, which is heavy, so he can't double. Let me actually see, can Elliewood double? No. Actually, yeah, we're just gonna wing it. There you go. Javelins are very important in this game because it allows a uh, one range unit to have two range attacks, which is godlike. Like the hand axe. Yeah, hand axe is the other one. All right, I'm gonna put Elliewood out front, which is probably not a good idea, but oh well. If At he doesn't point, level strength, we're gonna have to use. There we go. At this point, he's your second strongest unit, right? Well, I try to make him that way. I usually get him up to level five and then let other units do some stuff. You don't get any units that are actually worth it for a few more chapters, so he's gonna have to do some stuff here. Um, ooh, also Hector gets in this chapter, so that's fun. Oh, okay. I'm not skipping the Hector introduction cutscene because it's amazing. Okay, so this right. guy's on the mountain. So we're just gonna send Lawn over here to. I have never heard of a couple of these units. Yeah, if they're not in Heroes, chances are you've never heard of them. This is actually... Well, I've, I've heard of a lot of the units even outside of Heroes. You'd be surprised, I feel like. What does he have? Okay, so we're gonna have Elliewood buy some stuff. Buy an Iron Sword for himself, buy an Axe for Hector, and buy a Lance for Lowen. So that should do it. Also, um, speaking of Hector, the first, uh, legend I call them legendary weapons, uh, cause they're, like, weapons from previous games. The first legendary weapon I got in Awakening was, um, uh, Hector's axe I got on mods first, and I was like, awesome. Thank you for being a good face tank, though, and a good sport. Which, if he can continue to level speed, strength, and defense... He's- oh, frick. Whew. Okay, that's the other thing is the weapon triangle. Um, if you've never played Fire Emblem, basically lances beat swords, swords beat axes, and axes beat lances, so... Oh, here we go. Hector. You soldier, are you just gonna stand there and watch? Who do you think you are? This is Santa Cruz. What occurs here is no affair to you. I believe I'm going to have to disagree with you. He just kills that guy. <laughs> He's just straight up mercs him. Sorry, but I'm... What the frick? He just offs him. Yeah. Oh, Sarah. Ew, that's terrible. I loathe violence. Nicely done, my lord. You're a fighter born. Can I, 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 I dislike Sarah with a burning passion. Yeah, okay. If you've never played Fire Emblem, this is for you. Hector is probably the best unit in the game. Honestly. That never changes. Good to see. Hector, yeah, no, seriously. In every game that he's in, he's amazing. His stats are this at level 1, which 7 strength and 8 defense is really good, because he can fight these guys without taking damage. Or very, very little, at least. Oh, we also get this guy named Oswin, who is, um, I mean, pretty good. <laughs> Armored units are not usually. Good. Um, is it? Is, uh, what's her name? 
Uh, it starts with a G. A G. She's an armored unit. Gwendolyn? Yeah. Uh, I call her Wendy, but no, she's in Fire Emblem 6, and she's literally the worst unit in the game. People have sold the game with her. Yeah, it's... I don't know. We're just gonna let Hector deal with them. Um... Oh, jeez. Crap, I forgot that literally all of them just rushed straight down this little corridor here. So you're... Uh, Basically Lowen can handle screwed. it. Marcus, uh, you don't need him unless it's hard mode. Yeah, he's basically the collector of things for a while. He's your kind of your crutch at, to an extent. Oh, I can I can certainly use him to like win the game if I wanted to, but it hurts down the line because other units don't get experience. Hey Spencer, so, you're on your phone. I know. I'm looking at the GBA numbers. Wolf Beal. Yeah. Oh, 23, screw off. Okay, Loan gets another level. That'll work. <laughs> yeah, Loan becomes one of the better units. Um, no, that's not this game. Really, any unit who's uh, mounted is gonna be good. Just because the horses are so good in this game, honestly. I feel like Fire Emblem has a big balancing issue between games. No, it's like mobility is like the main thing in this game that's... Get fricked. Hector's animation is just, yeah. Doesn't Roy have like something in his game where you can like get Hector or something? Uh, like... It's one of the like bonus chapters. He, he appears not as like his lord class, but as a general. He just like freaking murders the guy. <laughs> I, I've seen the animation before. <laughs> I've also seen some of the parody animations that people have made, and they're freaking hilarious. Oh, yeah. It's like a book. <sighs> I, someone someone made it so that, like, they just, like, throw their tome at the en enemy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, I've seen one where Hector just, like, drops his axe and just punches the dude in the face. <laughs> Let me show you Oswin. I don't want to waste too much experience, but um, he's, he's cool. Oh, my gosh. Give for it. Yeah. Out of all of the armor knights in Fire Emblem, he's probably up there for one of the best ones. Uh, is Hector armored? Yeah, Yeah, he is. it's also Save the Wolf Bale. It will come in clutch in later chapters. Yeah, you get the cool stuff. Dorcas is pretty much useless, although I have to do something with him next chapter, so that's fun. Poisoned mutton. <laughs> yes. Just laser eyes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is where things get dicey, because they all just freaking swarm me. Wait, no. Is that this game? Uh, um, yeah, Nino. Yeah, Nino's in this game. But uh, she's... It is this game. Okay, like I said last chapter, if you know any of the units in the game that you want me to use, tell me and I'll use them, because it's, it's normal mode on Elliewood. Like, no one cares. Uh, see, I don't know what's good in this game, so... It's okay. I've played this game probably about 20 times. <laughs> I, uh... Is it your favorite? Th like I said, this this is my favorite game, so... I'm surprised you can't just, like, auto this entire game by yourself. I mean, I pretty much can. Well, let's get some lances. No, no, I mean... As an auto, I mean just, like, robotically flick through everything. Um... If I was using my old keyboard that I learned how to play this game on, then I could. Like, I used to be... Actually, no, I learned how to play this on the uh, phone, actually, surprisingly, so... Like, I, I can do it really fast, but I still need to get the, um, stuff down here. Uh, does Hector talk with Ellawood? You can do support... Actually, yeah, that's a good question. Because I kind of want to see that. Here, if I can get them in range of each other. Uh, I'd right. move Hector first, and then we can just... Well... Ooh, Hollywood soften this guy up. Who should I give this kill to? And no, Hector can't. Okay, that's nice. a good thing. I'd say just give it to the one, uh... Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I'd say give it to the, uh... Cavalier. The Cavalier, um... 
Okay. Here, we'll just... Boink. Are you- 93 missed, alright. So, I'll have to explain a mechanic called True Hit later. Let's handle this as a weapon. Um, what level is low in? Four and... Four, crap. Yeah, this guy is like, he hurts. He has 22 attacks, so... Jeez. Luckily, his hit rate is, uh, trash. It's, what, like, 74, which in this game is really bad. The weapon triangle is doubly effective in this game, because you get plus 20% if you have the advantage and minus 20 if you don't, so... Isn't that how it is in Awakening? No, it's only 10, I think. Okay, that's actually good for low and two. He's getting good levels, so he'll be usable. 10 defense is insane. Ooh, yeah, that that's, that hurts if he hits. I thought we were going to have them talk. I, I'm going to. I'm having Hector come in here. I want him to get this kill. Alright. Please don't hurt me, sir. Jeez. That looks... Don't oh my gosh, his health, too, is, like, really high. Yeah, he has a lot of HP. Why are you using the rapier? Uh, because it does actual damage. The, the Iron Sword has actually a lower hit rate than the rapier. No damage. So. Okay, Yeah, Oswin's then. invincible for the first few chapters until he encounters a mage. And then he's kind of dead, but then it's alright. I think that's how... <laughs> die. <laughs> Random crits. Nice. 4%. I'll take it. The battle um, music is really nice. That's my ringtone, if you've never heard it before. Is it really? Yeah. Actually, here, yeah. Hector! Yeah, so it's it's short and sweet. Hector, okay. Hector's a, a cool guy. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna have low and do damage. Because he can tank two hits because he's cool. Maybe he gets a crit, I don't know. Ugh, if he got a 1, I was going to be upset, because I really need Hector to get this kill. And then, we have Hector attack, and really hope he hits it, because otherwise, we're going to have to use Marcus. I'd say take a shot with Rebecca first. No, it doesn't matter, it's because he, he 1 hits it if he, if oh, he okay. can hit it. Let's just... Actually, let's, let's use this. 72 hit. There nice! Oh, <laughs> This was not so easy as it seemed. And Hector almost gets a full level because of this. Oh, jeez. Hector! That's why Hector's cool. As long as he doesn't get two speed screwed. Oh, crap, we have to defeat everyone? Five and eight. Okay, he's safe. When do you get a uh, healer? Uh, Sarah, I think, is the first one. Hector probably will live. If any of my lords die, the game is over immediately. Oh yeah, he's going for Loan, so... Oof. <laughs> just, just, just instantly immediately. screw you. It's like, maybe this wasn't a good idea. Alright, and that'll do it. It seems like we're gonna be one chaptering per episode, so... Yeah. Do you do you realize how broken this game would be if you if uh, defeated foes dropped their weapons? Oh yeah, well you have to buy them. That's what the money that you get is for. I know. Think nothing of it. All right. So basically, what happened up to this point? Because I've skipped most of the text. Um, Elliewood kind of left his country in search of like the people who were attacking. Hector randomly joined him with Oswin, and that's really all we know. Okay. These guys are annoying. Skip. All right, well, that's going to be that. Thank you for watching, and uh, I will see you next time. Remember, if you have any units you want me to use, tell me.